Aries, 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 doom, 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 Aries, Aries. What is up? It is pretty intuitive. Back with another one here, Aries. Let's see what is coming your way in love. Um, you know what? Let me turn on my mic before I almost forget. <sighs> okay. I don't want any interference. Alrighty, hope you guys can hear me. All right, let's take a look to see what is on your person's mind, okay? Um, this is their perception of the situation of you. It may or may not be true, okay? So let's just make sure that we are keeping an open mind with that, okay? All right. Before we get started, let's just... Um, Use these cards to see who this reading may be referring to more than likely. Okay, remember these signs could be um, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Okay, who is on Aries or well, who's thinking about Aries at this time? You have a Libra. Who think about Aries at this time? You have a Capricorn. Aries. You have a Virgo who's thinking about Aries at this time. You have a Sagittarius. You have an Aquarius, one more. And you have a Pisces, okay? Um, for those of you who care enough, we have Cancer as well. All right. Um, let's see what we need to know. Why are these signs thinking about you, what the freak is going on with them. Um, who is thinking about Aries? What is on their mind when it comes to Aries? Please? What is Aries love and just thinking when it comes to the situation with Aries or Aries uh, in general? Please like this video to show your love and your support on this channel. All right. What is this? Um, what is Aries love interest thinking, please, when it comes to Aries? What's on Aries love interest mind when it comes to Aries? Aries, what's on their mind is the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Swords, the Four, uh, sorry, the Nine of Cups, the Page of Cups, the Four of Cups. All right, Aries, so... What I'm getting here first and foremost is that you could definitely be dealing with a water sign, a Pisces, a Cancer, Scorpio. Doesn't have to be. But I feel like some this this individual here. Um, oh man, sorry about that, Aries. Okay, um, I think my mic cut out. But we have the Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords, Nine of Cups, Page of Cups. This could be a new person who has a crush on you who wants to shoot their shot. Um, this person sees you as their wish fulfillment and they're interested. Okay. Um, you are what they want. You know, they want to, um, tell you how they feel. Okay. Um, whether they get rejected or not, I feel this person's going to try here. Okay. Now, this person could be younger than you for some of you is what I'm getting. Okay. So you may not really be that interested because the four of cups. Okay. For those of you, yeah, it could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, it doesn't have to be, but for those of you, your person here is definitely thinking about coming through with a message here, a message of love. I feel like this person wants to express some emotion to you. Um, you know, this freak wants to tell you that they miss you or something like that, um, that they love you, okay? They may be ready to tell you those three-letter words, I love you, okay? With the Page of Cups, you know, they have romance on the mind when it comes to you, um, and they want to make their feelings known. You know, they want to make their feelings clear. At the end of the day, this this is this is what they're wanting to do here. Um, okay. Now, for some of you, I don't know what kind of history you have with them. I feel like them being rejected is something that they've considered. You know, you might reject them. I don't know. It just depends on who this person is to you. Um but yeah, they're coming in here with a message, um, even though for some of them, they know you may 
reject them or you may not be interested, okay? But they feel like it's worth a shot, you know? The Page of Cups is all about testing the waters. This is a really, like, playful... The Page of Cups is a playful energy, you know, like an innocent energy, like, hmm, let me uh, see what this does. You know how a kid can, like, get a yo-yo and be like, do like this to see what it does? So this person wants to test the water, okay? You have the Eight of Pentacles, okay? This could be someone that you work with. Okay. Yeah, I do feel like whoever this individual is may have a crush on you or something like that. Okay, or they just want to tell you that they love you, maybe for the first time or not. If this is an ex, they maybe want to tell you that they still love you or some shit like that. Okay. Yeah, with the page of coins being here, this person wants to express their interest in you. Could be an earth sign, sorry. Ooh, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Okay. But they are coming at you here. But, you know, the Seven of Wands and the Four of Cups is the only thing that's obviously concerning here. Because it's like, I feel like someone in a situation is like, you may be defensive, right? You may not want anything to do with this freak, okay? You may not. And for various reasons, maybe they're too young for you. Maybe you only see them as a friend. Uh, maybe this is an ex who fucked up. Yeah, someone someone could be uh, giving you some kind of apology here as well. They could be telling you that they're sorry. But it may not be something that you want to hear, okay? Some of you, this person feels as though they missed out. They feel bad, okay? So this could be an apology coming in as well, okay? But the lovers is here. I feel like for some of you may already be in a new relationship if this is an ex. Or you have somebody else and you're not necessarily keen on reconnecting with this individual, okay? Tell me more about this Ace of Cups, okay? So, yeah, this could be someone you're in separation with, but this individual here, um, they're interested for sure. And I feel like they're hoping to heal things with you in some way, shape, or form. Um, but it may be one-sided, okay? It may be one-sided. You may not be interested, okay, for various reasons. Some of you are getting this cup. This person was a player or they had some player-ish tendencies, um, for some of you, I am getting that this person is very immature, and that could be one of the reasons why you're you're good on them. Yeah, the Seven of Swords. Yeah, it's, it feels like somebody here is coming in with some kind of um, loving message. Okay, I'm sorry, I miss you, I love you, something. Page of Coins. But for some of you, I don't I don't think you trust this this freak's intention. Okay, um, because you're already guarded, you're on the fence. You're like, hell no. Yeah, some of you don't see anything else with this person. You're not even emotionally attached anymore. You're good. And like, apparently they're not. You know, they still want more. Okay. For others of you, this could be someone who's literally a friend, um, a co-worker or something. Maybe you go to school with them. Um, maybe this is a boss. I don't know. You may know them through business. You may know them through some way, shape, or form. But you may not have that kind of um interest in them, okay? This could be a friend who's confessing feelings or something, but if you don't want this break, okay? They're going to shoot their shot. They are going to take the opportunity to come towards you and let them let you know how they feel. You have the hangman. Um, but like I said, you're probably not that interested for some of you. Chariot, you know, this person, they want to try to work things out with you. What is the four of cups for Aries in this individual? What is the Four of Cups? Queen of Wands. It seems like someone's taking initiative here to try to shoot their shot, but I don't know. Doesn't it, it doesn't look like you're receptive? I'm sorry, Aries. It just doesn't look like you are. Um, this is not someone I feel like you are that interested in. Um, maybe you just like them as a friend or something. Okay, it's it's not really there for you, or it's because you know this person is full of crap. Okay, for some of you, so you're not um, you're not interested. Okay, so this is an interesting reading here. Um, you know, they're gonna shoot their shot here, um, but I mean, I don't, I don't know, Aries. I don't know if you want. From what it's looking like, this may be someone who missed out on you. Okay, or something like that. And now they're trying to get you back. They're trying to get back together for some of you. What is on Aries' uh, person's mind when it comes to Aries, please? What is on Aries' person's mind when it comes to Aries? Okay. 
So they're hoping that you and them can spark a new flame or some shit like that. That's what they're hoping for. Yeah, I do feel like this could be some kind of apology coming in here. We do have Libra. I don't know. For for a lot of you, um, for those of you watching this, I just want to feel like this reading is resonating more with either like um, a Pisces, a Cancer, a Scorpio, a Capricorn. I am getting that. Okay. I'm getting that strongly here. Whoever this individual is. Yeah, you know, it feels like this freak is like apologizing, okay? The Five of Swords. I'm getting that this person wants to apologize for their behavior or some shit. Okay, um, the way they treated you or maybe the games they played or something, it's just, it, it didn't sit right with you. And I feel like they left a bad taste in your mouth and I feel like you're good. You're good. You don't believe for one second their apology if this is an apology. Um, you know, for those of you, this is just a friend or something, you know, unfortunately for them, you're going to just tell them like, hey, you know, I don't have no kind of feeling. I'm sorry. It's unrequited. I'm not feeling that. I'm not feeling you like that. You're just a friend um, or some shit. Okay. Yeah, now this person shows up as a page, whoever this person is. Um, they're very like immature, pagey, uh, or maybe they're just younger, um, and you're just not feeling them. Okay. It does feel like you've moved on if this is some kind of ex, okay? Or someone who's telling you sorry. I just feel like you're gonna tell this freak to save it. Like you don't want to hear it. You have the hermit. So, I mean, yeah, I'm getting you've already moved on, and they're going to just have to accept that, um, and that's that. Yeah, see, because I, I see the um, the lovers here, you may already be in another situation, so you don't care, okay? <laughs> Snooze, they lose, um, sucks to suck, whatever uh, sucks to be done. I don't think you're looking at their cup here, Aries, okay? Um, what's on their mind? Let's see. Yeah, see, this freak made a big mistake. I'm hearing they look just like this. Whatever they did, it, it was a big mistake. It was a big mistake here. I, I don't know exactly what they did, okay? But it's, they fucked up. But I feel like this person's more centered on, I don't think they even understand the gravity, you know, of their actions. Like, they don't even understand, like, it feels it's coming, this apology or them feeling bad is more from a place of, what they lost or their current circumstances rather than them really recognizing and acknowledging and understanding where they actually went wrong with you okay um kind of like a selfish individual here whoever the freak is okay that's what i'm getting um yeah they're in a puddle of self-pity because of what they've done or something like that but again it just doesn't feel like um you want to hear it they're daydreaming and reminiscing. They got a uh, lonely one, and this freak is also very lonely. Misery needs company. This person's very miserable. Yeah, you might not even respond to this person when they come around. I'm hearing like you can save your 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 sorries for someone who cares. So I'm hearing this freak. Basically, it's Charlotte's Web, okay? They've con they've concocted so many lies here. And whatever lies they have, you don't want to hear anymore. Um, you might tell them to, to text the lies, okay? This is someone who, who's really deceptive, um, immature. It's like you can't trust what the fuck they're saying. Um, and you don't want their apology. It's just similar to Capricorn's reading divine timing yeah you're you're done this person really hurt you for some of you but yeah let me know down below areas how this reading resonates okay because this is really crazy but they still have the passion and the and the desire for you okay this freak is full of shame and guilt Now they're ready to take control and lead. Some of you, they made a poor judgment. Um, but that, that, like I said, that's up to them. Mirror reflection. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So this freak, 
is a lost cause I'm hearing, okay? Um, and this, this person's fucked up. They're fucked up over you, bottom line. So that's what they want to say to you. Um, some of you I'm hearing, like, you never even thought that you would, like, get some kind of, like, apology like this from them. Like, you didn't even, you didn't even think that. Okay. But it's coming. It's coming. All right. <laughs> Aries, so that is what I have for you guys. I hope you found this uh, reading helpful. If you did, please hit the like button for me, please. Um, before I go, let's, let's see how you feel about this read. Because I don't really... How does Aries feel about this individual that's coming towards them with this apology here? How does Aries feel about it? The Five of Wands. If they come towards you, you will curse them out. You feel um, argumentative towards them. You feel heated. You feel upset. Okay. You're not interested. You're on the fence. You're guarded. Okay. You feel like you could do so much better than them. Okay. How's Aries feeling about this individual here? Yeah, you feel like they broke your heart. You're healing from heartache. You know. And you've reached the point to where you're like, look, I know I'm much better without you. You know, you're not even worth my time here. Okay. Yeah, you feel like for some of this person is a player. Okay. And you're done with their games or some shit like that. You will curse them out. You will curse them out. You don't want anything to do with them. Okay. This person hurts you tremendously. Okay, for some of you. And this is how they feel, but that's their personal problem. Okay. All right. Uh, that is what I have for you, Aries. Love y'all. Um, remember, comment down below. Tell me what this is about. And talk to y'all soon.